Hey cycling friends, James with Team Finish Strong and I'm doing a cycling vlog today down at my favorite place to ride, the battlefield. Well, I'm doing this video today as a follow-up to my last video on living in overflow. I guess you could say this is part two. And you know, I wanted to say a little bit more about what it means to live in overflow. You see, it is not as much about what we do as it is who we are and who we're in relationship with. You see, when we are in Christ, when we claim him as our Lord, Jesus comes to live inside of us. And I think I explained some of that in my last video. But when he is inside of us, he's our source. He is our life. You know, Paul, in Galatians says that I am crucified with Christ nevertheless I live yet not I but Christ lives in me you see it's when we get out of the way when we die to ourselves and let Christ live in us and through us that's when we really experience life Jesus says that we should be yoked with him and that if we do he says his yoke is easy and his burden is light. And you know, that's the picture of a life lived in Christ. Scripture goes even more into detail about what this looks like. He gives us the perfect analogy, the vine and the branches in John chapter 15. Jesus goes into great detail to say how that he is the vine and that we are the branches. He's the source of life, not us. And apart from him, we can do nothing. And in fact, if you cut a branch off the tree, it will quickly die. It never had life in and of itself. It needs the vine, it needs the source, the root. And Jesus is that. And you know, when we make Jesus our source, God the Father, is our gardener and will prune us and make us even more fruitful, as scripture says. These are some wonderful promises in scripture. And Paul goes on to say some of the most cherished words in scripture that says in Philippians 4.13, I can do all things through Christ who gives me strength. You see, it's Christ from beginning to end. And when we live like that, we truly will live in overflow. Well, cycling friends, have a wonderful weekend. Take care, God bless, and as always, finish strong.